which one to buy what will be better which one is cheaper what's the difference between and what not hold on your breath i'm here to clear all your doubts regarding ips versus amoled display and which one you should prefer buying while purchasing a smartphone but before doing that check out our very own app the radness tech app if you're curious about technology and would like to stay updated in few minutes about the latest tech and tech news download it right now we also have monthly giveaways of some amazing tech products so why the wait pause this video right now install the app and try your luck the link is given in the description box below coming back let's get started with this video but before doing that don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon so that you get notified each time we upload a new video the dictionary states it is as to put something in a prominent place so it may readily be seen so the most that a panel can give you in terms of reality is the best display ever disagree give it a thought to make the right choice let's break down both the displays and find out what's inside ips lcd stands for in plane switching and the lcd stands for liquid crystal display to explain it simply there's a light source under every display or a glass that makes it to be a display IPS LCD was designed to improve the TFT thin film transistor displays but TFT couldn't satisfy the user as it had slow response time and was not enough for gaming which requires a faster response however IPS has a much wider viewing angle it's more consistent has accurate color in all wing directions and it has higher contrast with a faster response time being single panel it is easier and less costly to replace the display in case it breaks or gets damaged lcd panels have a longer lifespan as compared to amoled because amoled panel is covered with an organic layer and if the layer gets destroyed the panel has to be replaced however that depends on how rough or carefully someone uses the device active matrix organic light emitting diode also known as amoled is made up of thin layers of organic components and so each pixel transmits its light. The biggest difference between an IPS LCD and an AMOLED is that the IPS LCD has only a single panel that emits light whereas an AMOLED has multiple diodes that emit light simultaneously. Being expensive to manufacture, the AMOLED panel comes mostly in premium smartphones and devices. Apart from that, the diodes can be controlled on an AMOLED panel so that they are individual. That's why they come with better battery life since it supplies power only to those diodes which are emitting color. AMOLED display does not have same visibility in light as IPS LCDs. AMOLED dots reduce the color saturation of the panel. In the end, it all boils down to quality over necessity and how you want to spend depending on the type of usage of your device. If you are a gamer or someone who consumes a lot of media like videos, movies, AMOLED is always a better pick as the contrast ratio and the colors look better on the display. If you use your device daily like casual games and video viewing, you must go for IPS LCD since you can save a lot of money and get experience that you need. In the end, it's you who will decide the winner. But as per our verdict, if you have a budget, go for AMOLED. So I hope you had fun watching this video. If you did, make sure you hit the like button and share this video as much as you can. Also subscribe to the channel and turn on the bell notification icon so that you are the first one to get some fresh new content. Comment down what do you think about this topic. Until the next video, this is Ayush signing off. Stay safe and stay safe.